Alright, so I've been messing with Yoshi Star 1 Flutter recently, and I've found a setup for it, kinda, sorta, not really, that is seeming to be really consistent, and I'm probably gonna start trying to use it in runs. So I'll try to explain it as best as I can, but it kinda, there's some parts of this I can still vary. So if you look at this crack on the ground here, if you get Yoshi to line up with it kinda like this, you can hold up, then do a side flip and hold down, and then shake and just flutter backwards to the common metal. So this is different than what I used to do. I used to do a sideways infinite flutter, but the reason why I do that is because this actually sets me up with a consistent camera angle to do this flutter. So after this, I hold right to get Yoshi facing the right direction, bounce off the berry. You don't want to bounce too far back or else you're not going to get a good angle. And then from there, you want to hold between up and up left, and you should be able to, and if you do it that Okay, if you hold between the up and up left notches, and then do nine flutters, you should be able to dismount without a problem. Like that. Of course, this is going to require you to kind of count the flutters in your head, and sometimes it's easy to lose track of that at the start. So also what you could do is, as you're doing the flutters, once Yoshi kind of starts to bend in towards the direction, towards the planet's gravity, do one more full flutter and then dismount. And this also, and also keep in mind I am doing this on a completed file. It might vary with the Yoshi text, but I don't think it really should as long as you do the lineup. So right now I'm gonna try to show how this would look in an RTA, for me anyways. Overall, this is looking pretty good. I think I'm going to try to start using this in runs again now. Um, but hopefully this is also helpful for anybody else who wants to try learning this flutter and is having a difficult time with it. Alright. Uh, thank you for watching. Bye.